Oh, what a nice guy. There's a young man there from Strasbourg on a Honda and he was telling me that he rode around the UK last year and then uh, we took pictures of each other with our bikes. It's quite nice. But anyway, look where I am. Just, uh, I, I can't quite believe where I, found my, where I find myself. I mentioned it yesterday. This is the kind of place that I, I thought I would, I would only see in magazines and, you know, books or on documentaries. And here I am. I'm beside myself. Look at this, look at where I am. Not bad for somebody who started their motorcycle journey going from their home to the local Costa. And look where I am now. Come on! Look at the snow banks. Wow, what a road. The Fleur, Fleur La Pass. I know I'm pronouncing that wrong, but I really don't care. Jeez Louise, pinch me. Holy shit. Holy shit. Look where I'm riding. <laughs> I don't care if I'm doing anything wrong. I'm getting there, I'm doing it. <laughs> And I'm enjoying myself, which is the main thing. I just wasn't prepared for all of this. I didn't think I'd get to somewhere like this. special indicators but what <coughs> fuck oh wow it's frozen lakes frozen lakes You can just see it starting to melt, to thaw. So I guess that was the summit just there. And I'm starting the descent now. So good. Big grin on my face right now. I'm 
little squiggly stuff down there. Look at that view! <laughs> Look at the view. It's staggering. Oh, it's my friend again. Wow, that was spectacular and totally unexpected and very surreal. <laughs> what are you doing, man? What's your next stop? What is, what is your next stop? Oh, um, I'm going to Italy. Going to going across the border to Italy. I can't remember the town. What about you? Uh, uh oh, yeah, yeah. And, uh, yeah, I can't. <laughs> yeah, I can't. Stegel, but uh, Bolzano, Bolzano, Bolzano in Italy. Okay. Right, safe. Okay. Flawless. Tra Flawless translations there. What a lovely guy. Asking me what my next stop is. <coughs> I think he said he's going to the Stelvio. Holy crap, look at this. Some major squiggly stuff going on here. They are some big mountains. All credit to this guy. <laughs> Look where I am! There's just a big babbling brook going in between the mountains over there. You just see it. But unfortunately, it's going to be in my rear view mirror. Oh fuck! What a road! Road 28, for reference. And the Fleur La Pass. La Fleur, the Fleur, that's a character from Harry Potter. Look at that down there. All the pines. Jesus, this is just too much. Okay, with all of that, I'm still looking good for uh, around four o'clock to get to the hotel. 
it's so difficult not to stop to take in photographs because look at it I hope the cameras are running and taking in all of this stuff it's truly special what a road what a country mountain I, I just can't believe I've gone through a, a mountain pass with all the snow the switchbacks that is a major tick in the box of what I wanted to achieve on this trip wow staggering Look at Bubbling Brook! It's again pinching myself moment that I've managed to ride my bike all the way from Staffordshire to here. <laughs> Let's that around. There we go, better. We're coming into more squigglies. So do you. <laughs> oh, I didn't know how. Oh, there we go. There's the tight one. And there's my friend again. That's a good point for a photograph right there. playing tag with each other there. Man, I wish I did this years ago. But so I'm doing come on, let's get into gear. There we go. But I'm doing it now, that's the main thing. Enjoying these switchbacks. It's like conquering my fears, kind of thing. But these are fun. a rush this is such a great experience it's my, it's, I think it's the best day so far because of uh, more of a relaxed miles right off the bat yeah I had some problems with uh, looping around uh, uh, Davos going backwards and forwards a few times but you know look where look what I am look where I am look what I'm doing 
It's been these fantastic roads all day. I've loved every minute of it. Lichtenstein was there early this morning with the castle. Oh, I've caught up with this truck again. Oh, it was a re perfect way to say goodbye to uh, Switzerland. And the Fleur Pass. It's just breathtaking. Absolutely breathtaking. Shush! That was the way marker. Oh, perfect. <laughs> That's perfect. So there we go, that was Flew of Pass. I believe we're in Sush. So good. Oh, it's brilliant. So good. That's something I don't think I'll ever forget. Right, I'm going to get some gas, then uh, we can push on. All right, so I just filled up. I'm outside of Sosh, Shush, Shush, Shush. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to start heading towards Italy and uh, I'm going to turn the cameras off for a bit uh, to make up this bit of mileage and I'll pick it up again as I get nearer uh, the hotel and my digs. So it's not that far away, probably about a couple of hours. Um, so I'll see you in a little bit. So I'm about 30 minutes or 40 minutes down the road from that gas station but I had to pull in because this road just keeps getting better and better and better. And I'm going to run the cameras down till I get to my destination. And I'll catch up with you, you know, on the, the phone. Um, this camera's gone, which is a shame. Which means I'm sure the top box will go soon. But it's just spectacular, the views. And uh, I can't not film it so uh yeah enjoy the rest of the the road the ride and the road <laughs> mm. as we progress to the hotel i mean look at that look at that how could i i'll be uh vloggers would hunt me down for not filming this road is just so good and it's still the 28 number 28 in Switzerland so uh, yeah I think the plan oh look at helicopters holy crap there's several helicopters down there so, yeah I'll run the cameras down we'll get to wherever we get to But I think, uh, needless to say, it's just been an amazing day in the saddle. Amazing. So good. Today is what I was looking for from this trip.
Park Natural Swiss. So I'm guessing Swiss Natural Park, National Park. Look at that view. I kind of want to get a push on now to the hotel. We should get there for just after four, which is great. But um, it's, the, it's the want of taking more pictures is now holding me up. What's occurring here? More roadworks. traffic really Just uh, zoning out, listening to my tunes now, taking in this wonderful scenery. Oh, -ho, big drop. Oh man, I've got an RV and a truck in front of me, that's why. I don't know where to begin, how to begin to edit this footage. It just popped into my head. It's just going to be such a mammoth journey. I don't, I don't know the best way of doing it. But if anyone's watching this now, I hope you've enjoyed the journey with me. And thank you for being there. I've really appreciated it. I've only recently discovered how much it helps talking as if talking to you, the viewer. Because more often than not, I, I ride solo and it does help significantly Are we getting rid of now of course we're not getting rid of any of you oh goody he'll start Pushing on to beer o'clock now. something else it really is the whole experience it's taken four days so a couple of days longer than I thought to really bed in and sink and relax into into this this uh, this journey this experience and it is something else 
it really is. I recommend anyone out there to come to Switzerland. It's just incredible. I'll uh, do my sign off now I think because I know I'm going to lose you guys way ahead of getting into the hotel so yeah I'll uh, pick this up on the uh, phone camera when I get into the hotel but thank you for joining me on this one hands down best day so far been, been brilliant absolutely incredible and I uh, look forward to seeing what Italy has to hold and the Grossglockner after that which is pretty exciting so yeah I'll see you later on Amazing. Well, row 28 through the Swiss Alps is a good one. <laughs> I think that's an understatement of the year, right? Look at these roads. going on a ride in the UK is so never going to be quite the same. Oh, wait, scrub that. Scrub that speed. It's a lot chillier down here. Really cool breeze passing through. making my face a little bit numb. All the way around. Look at that. Great stuff. Jeez, man. How do you do that? the evil Wow, wow, wow. Officially a good day to be alive.
I think I've earned my riding stripes today with the roads that I've gone through. I've seen that. <laughs> Random motorcycle on a plinth. I've seen something very similar in the motorcycle rides through Europe book. Um, but it referenced the, the Groschglockner with uh, things like that, so maybe that's the thing to look out for. Oh, I love their stacks of uh, firewood outside. These big villas, chalets. The air up to here, it just smells fantastic. So fresh. Ow! Big bug just hit me square in the face. It's just jaw dropping. I could be looking at one of the pages in that book right now. You know, the best motorcycle routes through Europe. You know, whatever. Hey cows! One more squigglies. There was a sign there for the Stelvio there. Oh, I'm sorely tempted. It's the fuzz. Whiskey shop! Whoa, 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 whoa! Just going old school there. Using a paper map. Going good on him. I've got those in my pannier. That's a bit of a squeeze. I think the Stelvia was to my right, but uh, another time. Wow, well, check this place out. Yeah, it looks like a movie set. It really does look like a movie set. But it's real! <laughs> So, we're on here for another 11 kilometres and the last 30 have just been sublime. So hopefully the next 11 will be just the same.
we're on 1212 miles total oh we've got up to 22 degrees apparently apparently oh am i going straight Well, I've taken a slight detour, I think. Through this town. Oh, those folks are all dressed up in traditional fare. That was nice. There's a little detour there. It's crazy how the temperature changes so quickly. Border, we're at the border. I'm in Italy, baby. Italy. Oh, I can't quite believe it. Look where I am. Border control is just behind me. And I'm here, another country. That's three countries today. Anyway, photograph time. <laughs> 